I grew up in Rhode Island, and I went to elementary and high school there in Rhode Island. As I said, I became very interested in biological sciences in high school, and then I went to the University of Rhode Island, which is down on the coast. I actually grew up inland uh, in Rhode Island, which is hard to, since it's known as the ocean state, that's all of 50 miles from the ocean is where I grew up. But then I went down to the campus um, at the University of Rhode Island for my bachelor's degree, and that's where I started studying oceanography. They had a very big program right on the on the water there. And uh, from there, after spending a lot of time out on uh, the water in boats and frozen and cold and things like that. I decided that I'd go on to um, graduate school, but I decided I decided I had this love of the of the tropics and poss- possibly coral reefs. So I went down to the University of Miami to get a, a master's and a PhD. And sort of in the kind of work that I've done for most of my career, you pretty much need a, an advanced degree. You need at least a master's. And in most cases, if you want to be a professor at, at most universities, you need to have a, a doctorate degree to be able to do that. So. So that's been very successful in my career, to have that formal education. 